Hi, book two. Bill Rutenberg here with the Rutenberg Library. Uh, I wanted to come to you this morning with a book tag. I wanted to do the rapid fire book tag. I just saw this on uh, Bear Reads Books, and I thought this would be kind of fun. It's supposed to be kind of snappy, quick answers, and you know, you there's a whole bunch of them here. You you do one, you move to the next. You don't uh, you don't talk about them too much, and and uh, it's supposed to be quick and fun. So. I'm um, going to give this a give this a shot. Like I said, I saw this on Bear Reads Books. I'll put the link in the description down below. And then the original was done by Girl Reading. And I'll also put that link down in the description so you can get to those. So anyway, without further ado, here we go. Uh, quick, rapid-fire answers. Here we go. E-book or physical book? Physical. Paperback or hardback? Hardback. Online or in-store book shopping? For me, it depends. In-store, when it's available. I like to browse, whether that's new or used. But uh, when it's gift card time around my birthday and Christmas, I love Amazon. Trilogy or series? Uh, I would choose series. Couldn't a trilogy be a series? So why limit yourself? Series. Uh, heroes or villains? Heroes. A book you want everyone to read. I would love to see everybody read Stephen Ambrose's Band of Brothers and then go watch the HBO miniseries that they created based on that book. Great depiction of uh, World War II in the European theater. Recommend an underrated book. Uh, I would I'd recommend John Grisham's Theodore Boone series. Uh, it's just like his legal series with adults, but it's based, you know, it's a kid's version. And, and uh, I would say they're probably underrated because it's not his usual stuff, but they're still a lot of fun. The last book you finished, The Impending Crisis, 1848 to 1861 by David M. Potter. The last book you bought, The Chief Executive, and this was a book of inaugural speeches by all of the presidents. Uh, weirdest thing you've used as a bookmark. <laughs> I have went into the bathroom, forgot my bookmark, had a, I had a new book to start, forgot my bookmark and used toilet paper. <laughs> used books, yes or no? Yes. Most definitely yes. Top three favorite genres. Biography, history, historical fiction. Borrow or buy. By characters or plot. Character, because the character can drive the plot. Long or short books? I'm going to cop out and go with both. Long or short chapters? I like short chapters. Uh, they just they make the book, speed of the book go a little bit faster. Name the first three books you think of. Civil War by John Keegan. Self-Made Man by Sidney Blumenthal. The Impending Crisis by David Potter. Books that make, books that make you laugh or cry. Uh, Nicholas Sparks books. They always make me tear up. Don't laugh at me. Our World or Fictional Worlds. Most definitely Our World. I struggle with fictional worlds. Audiobooks. Yes or no? Nah. I'm trying them, but it's not really sticking. Do you ever judge a book by its cover? Yep. It's kind of like dating when you're younger. Yeah, you're judging that book by the cover. Book to movie or book to TV adaptations? I love book to movie. A movie or TV show you preferred to its book? Uh, Lord of the Rings. I tried the book. I could not get into it, but when it was on the big screen, I loved it. Series or standalones? Uh, when I look across my collection, I think i got to go with standalones. So this has been the Rapid Fire Book Tag, Book 2. I hope you enjoyed. I hope everyone does this. This is something for everybody. So I tag everyone. Have a great day, Book Tube.